Today we're going to check out the new episode of The Devil is a Part-Timer. In the previous one we found out that Mao is uh is is a papa and Emmy is a mama and there's a little baby and I'm wondering how, how the dynamics will change because she's not going to be very happy about this and now everyone's going to be taking care of a kid and, and who is this kid? What is what you know? I got questions. With that said, let's jump into it. But before we do, most of you are not subscribed to the channel, so support the content if you enjoy it and join the community if you haven't already. And you can find the full link as well as exclusives over on Patreon. She's feeling this maternal feeling right now. Uh huh. <laughs> Gee, no. <laughs> Baby. Ew. Ah, uh, she fell into the trap already. She's already in. Where's the kid at, man? Oh, there she is. Okay. Wait, can't go fly? Sus. Mm. Ah, dude, a man ain't going nowhere. Wing branch. Wait, does that mean that, um, Easy dub. Mm. Yeah, dude. They just need that child support from Emmy. <laughs> Emmy pay child support, and then I'll seal his mama. <laughs> you need to start sniping motherfuckers, then you'll be treated better. Mmm. Damn! He brought home a boatload. Ah, we're not get loud though. Shh. Stop getting so loud. Stop getting so loud. Baby's open. Or awake. What? Baby's open. Baby's awake. No? Damn, that baby sleeps through everything. That baby is sleeping through everything. Damn. She's worried about her child, man. <laughs> well, I mean, it kind of is, but no, it's not. I'm surprised Alciel didn't call up. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, Susie Nechan. Oh, she likes it too. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Damn, Alciel and, and Lucifer don't get uh, knee chans. Lucy knee chan. Al knee chan. I guess. Oh, it's Aisha, right? Aisha? I don't know how you do his name, but Lucy knee chan, easy. Mm. She likes it. She wants to be a mama. Who are these guys? These guys, this is the first time they ever got voice lines. What the hell? Mm. 
しばしの時間佐々木を借りてもよろしいでしょうとは私が預かる Damn, that baby's okay with just being picked up by somebody else? That's your daughter, after all. That's weird. He's been reduced from this angel to this. Well, I mean, he just put on weight. That's it, really. Yeah, I mean, he's still acting exactly the same. Tears of joy. I need to sneeze so bad. We're gonna hold it in though, unless it escapes me. <laughs> oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, Chine Chan. Chine Chan. Chine Chan. Hey, amusement park. Who's got money for this? Mama do. Mama got that paper. You're crazy. No way. You should go too, Chi. Wow. Were there like three tickets a pop or something like that? Oh, <laughs> she even wants to get all like beautied up and stuff. She almost spilled the beans. Ah, <laughs> damn, dude, that's disrespect, bro. You don't want to turn out like Lucifer, basically. This man lives in their closet. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Aw, he's so, like, admirable. In the end, you know, like, he's actually like a solid fucking guy. <gasps> That's the one! That's the one that did the spell! Hey, cheese going too. Ah, uh, dang, she got all dolled up. Nah, you're not at peace anymore. Oh. Gonna follow them. Duh. Oh. That's the voice. The legend himself. <sighs> she's the tree of life? Or she's a branch from the tree of life? Shit's about to get real. Oh. Shit's about to get real. Okay, so in this episode, we get the continuation of the previous. So we get to learn a little bit. Well, we don't actually learn a little bit more about the kid. Alice Ramis, right? She is this kid. Apparently her, her name in the other world language is Wing Branch. Now, at the very end, we see someone talking about restoring the tree of life. She's a branch from the tree of life. The wing part, I would assume, is an angel wing or something like that. She's a combination of it. I don't know. I don't know why Mama and Papa are Mao and Emmy. Emmy and Mao, whatever, respectively. That's weird. Don't know why that's a thing. But obviously, the kid is 
very in need of mama and papa, you know? She needs them because she's a kid. And so whenever mama or papa is not around, she makes a big fuss. But we find that in this episode, Chi Nei-chan is quite capable of helping. And I think the kid really likes Chi, which is good for, for her. And Mao says that Chi is basically the only human he can really depend on and trust. So that's awesome too. She obviously wants to keep on getting closer to Mao. And seeing Emmy there just now, after really getting herself fixed up, that's gotta be a bad sign for her. She probably sees that and she's like, oh, hold on, wait. You are doing what? Why are you trying to look nice? What is this? Chi and Alciel are following Emmy and Mao with the kid. They're going to this amusement park. That's what we're gonna get in the next episode, an amusement park episode combined with a battle or at least the start of a battle because we see that this gate opens up at the end. That's what Lucifer recognizes. I love how Al Shield just always takes the opportunity to put down Lucifer. It's hilarious. And then beyond that, I really love how these interactions are, especially like Chi, the way that she like is responding to the whole situation, pretty funny. Now, Mao has decided that he is going to basically have custody of the kid because he's got himself, but he's also got Alciel and Lucifer there inside the house to help take care. And also next door, they've got Suzu. No. I don't remember her name, but they've got next door neighbor, Suzu. She has now also become an Onei-chan and she is going to probably help out a little bit. I'm really telling you, man, they should have Emmy pay child support, basically. <laughs> that would be, it'd be kind of funny. I'm just mostly excited for this battle that I think is coming. We're going to get a part amusement park, part battle episode. Next episode should be fun. I think that it probably will just start up a battle towards the end of it. And like the actual battle, battle battle will be in episode four. That's my best guess. Regardless, I'd love to know what you all thought about this one down in the comments below. Did you find it really funny? Did you, you know, how did you find that end part of it? Are you also putting two and two together? Restoring the tree of life, wing branch. Kind of feels like she's part of the tree or something. I don't know how she turns into a person, but obviously the one in the white hair with the ring probably has some sort of something to do with it. Ah, I would assume the mama papa being Emmy and Mao is to protect the kid from these angels. Makes sense. Leave a comment down below. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. And until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.